The Christmas tree often goes up right after Thanksgiving and WDRB's Dakota Sherrick shows us why pickings may be slim this year if real tree buyers don't get out and shop soon. Whether they've been in the business for decades or just a couple years, people running Christmas tree lots are running into the same struggle because of a Christmas tree shortage. These are the five and six footers over here. Joel Gonye. We can go pull some out until you find the one you want. Owner of Honey Bear Farms in Louisville. They're big trees. Is new to the Christmas tree business. It's just fun. I'm referred to as the bee guy around here most of the year, but during Christmas season, it's my favorite time of the year. I just love it. Last year, he was off to a good start. And we're really successful. We sold out in the first two weekends. But a shortage of trees means they're hard to come by. It's hard to find trees. You got to pay for them right then or else the tree farmer is just going to go somewhere else. Gonye says he started looking for trees in January and prices went up 15 to 20 percent from last year. We're not making as much money as we would like to make, that's for sure. Across the river in Jeffersonville, John Martin is noticing the same thing and he says it's an industry-wide problem. I think it's a tremendous tree shortage and it's not only here but it's all over the United States and uh, it's going to be that away for the next couple of years. You ready? Yes, sir. Martin's Christmas trees has a long history. I love selling Christmas trees, make people happy. I've been here 53 years. Last year, he was sold out by December 12th, a first in five decades. We got more trees than we had last year, and hopefully we can sell more trees and stay open longer. And I'm sorry for the people that didn't get a tree from me last year. It really breaks my heart. He says the problem is a lack of growers. Christmas tree growers years ago, they weren't making that much money on the trees. A lot of people quit growing them. A lot of mom and, lot of mom and pops were small. They quit growing them. Since trees don't grow in a day, it'll take some time. Woo. But Martin believes in a couple years, growers will catch up to demand. In the meantime, we just have to go with the roll, I guess. A mantra many sellers have as they continue working. So everyone can take a piece of Christmas home. All right. For people who do want to buy a real tree this year, it is recommended you shop sooner rather than later. Dakota Sherrick, WDRB News.